So which should you pick? Death Adder Razor V3 Hyperspeed, or should you be picking something like the Lamzu Thorn, which is very good as well? We're going to sit there, compare these today. I'll give you my thoughts on which and which one I should pick, which one you shouldn't pick, and also the differences in these mice if you know it's still torn and you're not sure which one to pick. So let's take a look at them in more detail. So if you're not sure I am, Biddy Bob, game 35 years plus, willing to Valorant at the minute if you like to see old man gaming. I'll show you all the intricate bits of mice, I take them apart, I review them, I compare them, do all that kind of stuff. If you want to see something particular, let me know. Hopefully this will give you a competitive edge watching these videos over your rivals. Let's compare it to the Thorn, I guess. Be a good idea. So Razor Death Adder, V3 Hyperspeed, Thorn, Lamzu. I know like the middle scan of the Thorn, but let's have a look. Quite different shapes, aren't they? What do you reckon you're gonna pick? I don't know, kind of, it's quite aggressive, the slant on the Death Adder versus the Lamzu. You prefer like a more subtle, more subtle shape. White looks nice, always looks nice white, doesn't it? 18 by nine hand. For me, the razor fits better, gotta be honest. It just feels like it's a bit more snug. Feels like it's a bit, bit bigger on the rear there, Lamzu. We'll measure them up in a minute, compare, but like I said, if I, I said about my angle of my mouse, like the Lamzu, it's probably where I would hold it. Razor maybe not. The razor feels like I hold it more at an angle. So there's the three I'd hold an Ambi, another very good, but the razor for me twists a little bit in my hand, I think, for holding it. So anything that might put me off. Let's give it a little bit of a measure comparing it. 22. Similar. A lot of thorns may be a little bit shorter. Probably because of the button. Got the overhang of the razor. He's got the biggest booty. I knew it'd be that. I said it was wider, didn't I? Look how much wider that is. Holy moly, she's got a big booty, the thorn. It's got more got more chunk. It's chunkier. The main highest point, 41, pretty high. I think I said the Lamzu again is a bit higher. Feels like it's a bigger format. Yep. It's chunky, the uh, Lamzu, isn't it? It's chonk. She's a thick boy. This one doesn't. It's a nice bit of, it's a nice firm scroll wheel. The Lamzu's a little bit thinner. Not quite as sturdy. I, I, I could tell when I held them. They're, Palm in the chunkiness and the girth, you know what I mean? I could feel it in my hands. Used to holding something a bit bigger in there, man, so. Razor felt a bit skinny. It's got bigger buttons, this one. So overall, the thorn's a little bit chunkier. Your profile. I prefer the skates on the Death Adder as well, to be honest, on this one. I like a bit of a bigger skate as well. And they're a nicer PTFE. The only thing Razor's got more chunkiness on is the side buttons. <laughs> I'm gonna have to see how the, I'd say the Death Adder, but I'm gonna have to see, so I need death myself, I'm gonna have to see how the Death Adder plays with that way it kinks in my hand a bit. That's my only concern with it, is how it's, it's twisted in my hand. But it's a good build from Death, it's a good build. Both, both are built well. Either one you'd like, I think, but I'd probably take the Razor slightly over it. Just the shape. Shape's nice, but it twists. Tough pick, yeah.